All right, y'all, I just ran into Adrian right here. He's gonna give us a little bit more insight on what we got right here in front of us. And you asked Ed, Edmund Mondi, right? Yes. With the Porsche, the crazy yes. guy, always yeah, doing that yeah, crazy yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. I know exactly who you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. so this is his car. Wow. Yeah. Is he here? Uh, no. Oh, I'm about to say, he's pulling up on us? Yeah, he's going to be taking delivery of it uh, later this week. Wow. Yeah. So this will be delivered to LA, I'm guessing, is where he's staying? Uh, Button Willow. Button yeah. Willow. Straight to the track. Oh, wow. Yeah. Dude, that's going to be crazy. This looks like a like the Batmobile over here, yes. man. Oh, yeah, definitely. What are the specs on something like this, man? So this is, uh, you can consider your entry-level model, GTX. Yeah. Um, it's 550 horsepower, give or take. Wow. Audi five cylinder with the hauling gear sequential transmission. Wow. Uh, the car full of fuel with the driver is 2,300 pounds. Oh man, okay, so that's not same, too bad. Yeah, yeah, the same way as your 98 Honda Civic. The car is really well balanced um, with the aerodynamics and just how low the car is able to sit. Um, it's able to take turns almost prototype level. At an insane rate. Correct. Wow. Dude, this is a beauty right here, man. I've never seen something like this, ever. Yeah. Wow, guys, you guys heard it. KTM right here, GTX. Crazy, crazy build. And a little bit about that KTM, the blue one over there. What's that What's that one talking about so over there for you? The blue you? one is the same. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's our team one uh, that we've been using to you know, do a lot of development. Um, and we've been taking it to a couple races so far. Oh, we yeah. just did NASA. Um, so with that, we did more development, found the weak points of the car, and resolved them with KTM. Wow. Uh, so this is the team car, uh, CGR Motorsport. Yeah. Based out of Vegas. Based out of Vegas. Yeah. yeah. You guys heard it right here, man. I'll definitely plug that in the description to show some love. Yeah. Hell awesome. yeah. Everything is the same. It just this one has GT2 wheels, mm -hmm. uh, which are about five pounds lighter than the, the factory ones. The that blacks. we have on the black one over there. Correct. Yeah. Okay. So the GTX is your entry level model KTM. Uh, your premier version, you could say, is the GT2. Okay. That one has a built five, Audi five cylinder, different turbo, 100 more horsepower, lighter wheels, lighter floor, oh, wow. and more aerodynamics. Damn. Yeah. Dude. And this is you. This is you. You work on these cars right here. Yes. Dude, yeah. that's insane. And Cigier. Cigier. Okay, I was reading yeah. your shirt. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right here, y'all. Cigier Motorsport. That's who's lucky enough to work on these beauties right here, man. Yeah. Dude, Adrian, these are crazy, man. I really appreciate you taking the time and course, chopping dude. it up on the channel for me, yeah, too, man. I love that. I love yeah. that. That is wild. We're, Jeez. A, we're an official KTM dealer, so we're able to sell you cars. Oh, hell uh, yeah. Full race support, everything at the track. You know, we're able to provide it, hospitality. Nice. Now, do you, when you guys head out to Button Willow with Edmund Mondi, is it going to be open to the public for like someone yeah, to get It's an open like... track day. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so you're definitely able to go in, you know, pay the entry fee, and then you, okay. can, see, you can see him on track. You know? Hell yeah. yeah. I might have to see if I could sneak in the passenger seat yeah. with him. Oh, no, yeah. Oh, so man. On that one, yeah. Uh, there is no passenger seat. Oh, man. Uh, I guess, yeah. But this one has the instance for it. Okay. Yeah. Damn. Well, then I guess I'm going to have to ask Edmund and let me know what's up with this one. Yes. Huh? <laughs> Dude, even the steering wheel, the the now the center the center console kind of reminds me of the Ford GT. How it has yeah. everything kind of lined up? Yes, yeah. It's nice. It's sick, man. Beautiful cars. Now, give me an MSRP on something like both these cars. Two hundred eighty thousand. Two hundred eighty thousand. Taxes and everything out the door. Right wow. Now. I was expecting something along the lines of maybe like a Pagani one point eight or like a Monza one point eight price. You know, no, like yeah, a million. Yeah. Yeah, so wow. these cars are very affordable for what they are. Hell yeah! Um, the GT2 model is about three hundred eighty thousand. Okay. Um, but it's fully race ready to go. Uh, you know, we take delivery at it at our shop. We do a, a setup depending on the track that you're going to. We'll do a setup accordingly. How the lanes are moving and all Correct, that good stuff. Yeah. yeah. And then we will you know transport the car for you and uh, you know, whatever racetrack, home, wherever you want to go, we'll deliver it. Man, 280 is not a bad price, man. We pull some strings and maybe we can get myself in one, yes. you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs>